Hi guys, welcome to my second review of the uh, Institute of Trading and Portfolio Management. This is for the Professional Trading Masterclass video series. Now, this is the Mecca. This is what you've come here for. This is completely different to all of the other trading educational platforms that are online, from my opinion, and what I have been able to find. Um, there is over 64 hours worth of video footage within this series uh, taught by Anton and also Chris Quill who runs through some of the spreadsheet classes. Uh, there is over 43 videos within this series. It is quite comprehensive which is fantastic for us as retail traders. We're trying to get every bit of information that we can that improves our understanding of financial markets and how we should be trading within that environment that emulates professional traders, right? That is what this course is about. So a bit of a structure of all this and how it's run down in a list, if you haven't already gone through it yourself, Anton sets the scene with a framework of how we should be operating as retail traders um, from a top-down macro viewpoint, creating a worldview and I guess market bias for how we see things happening now as well as into the future. He starts to go through uh, some key leading indicators as well as some understanding of money markets and volatility again, which is good. Um, as you can see, yeah, gross domestic products, leading indicators. There's a spreadsheet class here about leading indicators and how we can use them to our advantage. So there's one thing about getting the information and then there's another way about of interpreting it, which Anton and Chris teach you within this series. Uh, the leading indicators and how we can use them on a rolling basis to, f to continue our understanding of the market bias that we are keeping, if we are one or if we're changing from the information and the analysis that we're conducting. Then Anton always at the end of like a section, which is how this PTM video series is set up, he'll recap everything that you've gone over, which is handy for us because it is quite a comprehensive course that we're understanding the key elements of the things that are getting taught to us. The video series is quite long, right? You're seeing that they're half an hour, an hour, two hours. You can slow this down or you can speed this up within the, each of the videos to suit your liking. And the other good thing, again, is that you can go back over the content if you've missed something or you haven't quite understood something. This series is taught for retail traders, right? It's not, um, it's not dumbed down again. It's not dumbed down, but it's very structured. It's for us to get a, a good sound basis of understanding and progressively work our way up that understanding so that we can create, so that we're competent in what we're looking at and how we an analyze it to a sense. After going through uh, some leading indicators and the framework of how Anton has structured this PTM video series, we're starting to get taught about long short portfolios there's some spreadsheet classes here where we're taught with the downloads that they have here um, about how to create a long short portfolio correlations variances understanding risk tolerances and some efficiencies that anton says that we should achieve um, when we are creating long short portfolios in the second half of the video series Anton uh, starts to go through trade idea generation, how we formulate trade ideas as retail traders um, from a quantitative perspective, as well as then narrowing it down to what the best of the best sectors are versus the worst of the worst and how we then roll through to finding which companies are operating the best within those sectors. It's quite a good approach for us retail traders. I guess typically before, if you're trading shares or whatever, I'm sure that you might not have taken that approach. I myself personally didn't. It's just generally was used to be word of mouth or I would go on to 
combis and look at what they were offering as a package. Um, so the education in this and teaching you a structured process for how to generate ideas to start out is really good um, and worthwhile. Once you start to go through this, it really starts to unravel your understanding. You go, okay, this is, this is something else. This is really good, which is what I took from it. After running through quantitative uh, processing for trade ideas, we start to break down the trade ideas of key companies that we might have found that look good for us to do further research on. Um, and then Anton starts to roll through some catalyst uh, key points that we should be trying to find when we're looking at trade ideas. There is further information here about like other ways of generating trade ideas from a macro perspective through international um, markets and how they might be listed on the New York Stock Exchange. And at the second half of the video series, Anton starts to narrow in on technical analysis and price action. Within this course, uh, it is a very fundamental viewpoint um, for generating trade ideas, which is perfect for me um, and I think perfect for retail traders. Um, we're trying to encompass a whole lot of information and filter it down so that we can create trade ideas, right? That's what we're trying to basically understand. Um, and this is putting you in the sweet spot for finding them and understanding how you should find them. Finally here, closing at the tail end of this professional trading masterclass series, Anton starts to go through key risk management techniques as well as some trading psychology for us because trading is uh yeah it's a it's a different beast right it's different from most of us from what we encounter on a day-to-day -day basis with our normal jobs where there's a lot of information out there you can get lost in rabbit holes which a lot of us have done when we've tried to do this on the, our own especially me i used to um, so understanding, yeah, at the end of all this, once you've pulled it all together, that you still have to manage this on your own and as a retail trader and how you should be thinking um, as a retail trader as you're rolling through and managing your own portfolio. Uh, then finally, again, uh, there is a exam here. Um, the exam is not mandatory again. There is sufficient time to complete each of the questions for sure. It is quite a long exam from what I can remember when I did it, uh, but you do get a certificate out of it. And the premise of the certificate is that if you're wanting to go on and do a mentoring program or wanting to get uh, some a certificate for applying for a job at a hedge fund or investment bank then it definitely comes in handy but for people who are wanting to do a mentoring program you have to complete the IPLT video series the PTM and the POTM before you can do the mentoring so yes I highly recommend this course this is what I've been telling my friends and family about um, because it is so comprehensive right there is so much content in here it is um, something that is not over oaring. You just have to do it at your own pace. Okay, like I said, there's 64 hours worth of stuff in here. When I was going through it, I just did one a day. Um, sometimes I go over it again if I needed to, just to solidify my understanding. But this course is by far uh, the, the best thing that is available on the internet today. From an educational standpoint for retail traders wanting to have a professional approach towards their trading. So there you go guys. Uh, thanks for going through all this with me and um, that is my review of the PTM video series.